could see his wonders. My name's Sonia Shatt. I've had a chance to sing in the production of The Lamb of God, the Oratorio. I've loved this music for years, and when I heard they were going to be performing it here, I, I, I really wanted to be part of the choir. I had people try to persuade me to do something different, but I, I wanted to participate with the music. There is something about music that penetrates right to my soul. And the music in itself is beautiful, but put together with the lyrics that carry so much meaning about something that matters deeply to me is, has been an experience of a lifetime. I have enjoyed simply practicing and it's interesting to me that since I started practicing this once a week, this is the music that is always playing in my mind. I love the reminder of the importance of Jesus Christ, but it touches me deeply to know that the gift he gave me came in situations in his life that resemble very much my life or other people's lives and the victory, as in one of the songs, and the hope came at the time when it looked like he was in his deepest, he could have been in his deepest despair. Hope looks different when you're in the middle of something like he was, and yet he kept his dignity. Each one of the numbers shows this whole experience of the crucifixion and the resurrection from a different point of view. And for that reason, it's easy to assimilate for just almost anyone. There's Peter, who wasn't quite as consistent as he wanted to be, and yet he became very, very um, committed. He had a deep conviction of the importance of the Savior, but in a different way later on. There's Mary, his mother, Mary Magdalene. Uh, so many of the characters that represent different relationships with the Savior. More than anything, I like being reminded with the music and the orchestration that there is hope and it's wonderful to feel like you're part of that heavenly choir. That's what it feels like to participate in this production.